Welcome, young ones, to a harrowing tale of the consuming shadow. It started with the young boy known as Blake. Hello? <laughs> and then he died. <laughs> Thank you for paying attention to our tale. Chalk ices are available from the hallway, from Mrs. Gibson. It's two pounds, three pounds if you don't want her to touch your face. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. What about that? <laughs> that was a weird. Sorry, I was supposed to introduce the episode, and I had a flashback <laughs> from the mind, the demented, crazed mind of young Nathan. <laughs> That's what. So we played the Consuming Shadow. I love this game. This I is, Nathan said it's scary, and I don't really like scary it, games. It, but I would say it's scary, but it's it's tense. It's atmospheric, as I would describe it. I like because tense. it's 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 graphically simple. Um, you know, it's oh yeah, it's mostly sort of in in shadows and whatnot because of the title and everything. Yeah, and, makes um, sense. So there's like little detail to everything. So like it's all up to the imagination as to what the fuck is happening. And we've always said imagination's always worse than what you actually see. Like especially, monsters might have. You keep them all in the darkness so our imagination can run wild. Especially Mrs. Gibson's imagination. Oh god, I know. the things she does to people. I've heard her, her about stories about her and that rolling pin that she carries around with her all the time. They never found that boy's skin, you know. No. Anyway, not, Blake, would you like to start the game? Not only that, right? I heard she was having it off with a mortuary attendant once. <laughs> Got through 18 coffins one weekend, I heard. That's just, no wonder she's round shouldered. That's just what I heard, anyway. <laughs> anyway, let's read this bit. Okay. April 21st, 2012. That's a bit too close to home for my life. <laughs> a shadow is trying to enter our world. One of the ancients. The runes confirm it. I don't know which one. That's fucking handy. Yeah. All I know is that they arrive at Stonehenge three days from now. One hope remains. The ritual of banishment. Four runes. <laughs> Sorry, some sneezing in the background. Encanted at Stonehenge. We'll close the gate away. The, g- the, the trouble is, I don't know what the ritual is. Who are we playing as? <laughs> some nitwit from the Ministry of in Mysterious Happenings. If I investigate the strange events heralding the shadow, maybe I could piece it together. That's all I have. A maybe. And right, about, and do you want to start the game or do you want to kill yourself? I kind of want to kill myself. Just to see it. But that's kind of like just me all the time anyway. So. I'll, I'll tell you now, the game gives you plenty of options to kill yourself later on. <laughs> okay, well let's begin now because I can get, I'll get the chance later on. So, Oh, you've got a text from the Ministry of Occultism. Oh, that's lovely. Cursed towns are the best place to find what you're looking for. You might make some immediate headway if you went to Saxham. Let's go... Sexham! Let's go to Sexyham. <laughs> yeah, so you sort of click off the mobile to get rid of that. Piss off. Yeah, and you can sort of go right, you can check your uh, items there. You don't start with a lot. You've okay. Got, you've got a med kit, which contains... Um, basically, it heals you. Um, and you've also got these illegal drugs up here. Most likely heroin. <laughs> For when your sanity goes down, it's a temporary restoration of sanity. So what you're saying is, if I start taking heroin, I'll be a lot more lucid. Yeah. I think I might start taking heroin then. <laughs> so they want okay. us to go to Saxon. That's what that's what they say. Basically, okay, this has changed from the uh, beta, because I played a lot of the beta. In the beta, it would tell you like what towns were what. Red dots, I'm assuming, are dangerous places. That's where you want to go if you want to find clues. Other... Which we need to find, yeah? Yeah. You need you need the clues basically to get to Stonehenge and um, to, to do the banishing ritual as he said earlier. So it's kind of like in a way faster than light. I'm trying to get to kind the bottom of. to get to the end of the game. Yes. But I can meander around as yeah. long as I like. Basically, but... you need to get supplies. You need to get clues. Yeah, I need to Just... get myself ready to fight the monster at the end. Yeah, and while I would... also finding out what the monster is. Yeah, and while also not being late. I'll tell you now. You want? I I highly doubt you'll make that. You're win this game. I'm going to fucking prove you wrong my friend. <laughs> Let's go to Saxum. Yeah and then we just uh, drive along and don't, That's nice. we don't look now, back. Now it's a lot nicer than this than it is playing uh, some sort of like oh, Euro truck. Or yeah like you get that. interrupted every now and again. I've got reports of a sleeper cell in Hobbleton. Needs clean up sooner rather than later. Do it or don't. But if you don't the town won't be safe for long. So yeah basically you get sort of semi missions that are time restricted okay and yeah like they'll tell you to go to Hobbleton at some point but I'll say you're on your way to Saxham go to Saxham right because a sleeper cell doesn't sound that dangerous well I'm honest according to him it is because like when you get there they're all asleep right so <laughs> it's like all they've got the town's got like a NyQuil factory a on top of the hill agents. yeah they've got a NyQuil on top of the hill and it's just running into the local water supply and everyone's just gonked out on NyQuil all the time Blake you are our protagonist would you kindly read from your journal I would love to April 21st 2012 11.44am Saxon 
Kenneth spoke to me again today, and I thought that... Oh, sorry, I'm reading the wrong thing. Um, I was reading from my book. Um, I am immediately suspicious of the genitals. Gen- g- g- <laughs> I read it as genitals. The people of this town display. They smile but rarely blink. They're all lizard people and invite me to some private meeting place within minutes of conversation. I don't like this already. <laughs> Some unaffected ones pull me aside and warn me off. Many Come have been... in, have a cup of tea! <laughs> Many have been taken, they say, and return changed. I hear disquieting tales of physical transformations concealed between clothing and cosmetics. I am convinced that a dark power operates beneath the surface, infecting bodies and minds wherever its oily tendrils settle. So it's like basically a, Peterborough. Like a, <laughs> like a Japanese hentai. All the oily tendrils. <laughs> Sorry, I interrupted your joke. No, that's fine. You're almost better than mine. Shall we investigate further or are we going to get done fucked up if we do no, that? If you investigate further, that's, you basically go into uh, dungeons that are very similar to what you'll find. It's sort of a, it's sort of a 2D kind of um, Legend of Zelda. Oh, I love Legend of Zelda. Let's give it a go. The bewitched residents of the town turn oddly... Turned oddly recal- recalcitrant. Recalcitrant. When I... isn't, isn't that what you put in a car? <laughs> isn't that like a form of petrol? When I actively begin to probe, hello, this is about the, the technicals again, the location of their meeting place, but I have now pieced it together. An extremely modern building in the town central. It's in like it was district. built last week. <laughs> like, literally, like, come to like the openings today. Like, <laughs> <laughs> apparently paid for by some unspecific religious group. Oh, it's that Daesh um, coming down into Saxon, stealing all our nutters. I will attempt to maintain the persona of an interested potential recruit. Although my instincts tell me that a disguise may become irrelevant once I penetrate the approachable facade. Did Yancey Croshaw swallow a fucking thesaurus when we started writing this? <laughs> Can we investigate further, do you reckon? I don't know. I mean, I think the guy you're playing is kind of a pretentious douche. Right, so how do I shoot? Um, I believe clicky, you clicky. click, yeah. I think it tells you on the way. Find and exterminate the large creature bewitching the town. I so thought... you get messages sort of at the beginning of each one that tells you what you have to do. That's fine, but I thought I didn't think we were like an exterminator. I thought we were like a religious cultist bloke. <laughs> Why are we now Bit getting rid of both? Getting rid of. Oh. Ah. There we are. You, you done it. Did it in. Oh, um, yeah. These boxes, you can. They have clues in or items of interest. In the language of the ancients, the syllable agon is usually given as a name, but has also very seen been written to denote the concepts of insanity, irrationality, and confusion. Okay. So, I'm confused yeah. now. Go to the um, the table. Okay. So basically... Um, I'm at the, the table. Uh, God one rune. Sort of check, click that until it goes to Agon. And aspect, you, or you want, kind of want to go for madness? Yeah, madness. I think that's for it. all of them. Or... Yeah, when you get sort of symbols, that's kind of what you want to do, just to make sure that you've got... Every, all, so I can work from there. Yeah. Do I need to do that for all of them? Um, or are they all different? It's, they're all different. So sure, wait till we find another clue. Yeah. And before then we can, you go we can, ahead, we can work from there. Yeah. Okay. So go down again because you missed one from the last room. Okay. Let's have a little looky over here then. <laughs> what the? <laughs> the fuck is that? Worshippers consider it a grave insult to draw Kathoth's symbol in white, as this is the colour which is associ- associated with one of their oldest, bitterest rivals among the ancients. So we know this Kathothoth fellow. Kathoth. Kathothoth. Doesn't like white. He doesn't like the whites. He doesn't like the whites. That's right, you can close that. I don't think we can do anything with the table. He, with um, he, he, he's a racist one. So yeah, that's what you can pick up. There's a survivalist cash containing three hollow point bullets. Okay, oh. so I can't get through there. You can't, you've can't. you got a 15% chance of pick-locking it. Oh, I'm not going to... Pick-locking it. Pick-locking it. But so I, I don't really bother with pick, lock-picking. I can so, open all the doors now, so yeah. I, can, I can open this door. Yeah. Oh, I tell you, this is very spooky, very atmospheric yeah. from the get-go. Oh, there's a thingy over here, look. Yeah, so you've got your table in the bottom. That basically tells you where you are and where you started. So you Excellent. started there, there. Does it freeze the time while I'm reading these? Yes, I believe it, d- it does. fantastic. The animosity is rooted in the suffering reportedly endured by a worshipper of Gnix while captured by the cult of Chizo. Chizo worshippers seem to tell the story the other way around. I've not got the end of the story the first way around yet. Gnix appears to be the enemy of Chizo. Okay, fine. But we don't know which one's which yet, do no, we? we don't. We don't know what that, the, who the fella Ooh, is. There's a note attached to that fire extinguisher, it seems. Use in case of fire. That's strange. A single diary page has been stuck here. At least I'll have something to read when this is over. Can I read this now? Apparently not. Apparently, Apparently you're not. too busy. Too busy. Just just twatting around Look, doing stuff. Walking around what seems to be a hospital. Like banging my face off all the walls because I can't figure out where I'm going. Oh, yeah. There are a couple of uh, things. Oh, um, I went this way. Basically, your sanity drains if you leave a room while there are monsters still in the room. So I need to kill all the monsters. Basically, yeah. But obviously that's not... Also, you can right-click to attack 
melee attack monsters rather than shoot them. It's ammo and limited supply. Yes. You've only got three 9mm standard rounds and three hollow point rounds left. He didn't come very well prepared, this fella, did he? No. He only came with, like, one magazine. Didn't even come with a screwdriver or anything, just to give him a backup or something like that. <laughs> the carving dates back to at least 6,000 BC and depicts Nyx play, uh, paying blessings and tribute to a figure labelled the God of Fear. Its value as an antique is unfortunately meagre. Meagre. So, okay, that's brilliant then. That's, mm. oh, I'm piecing this together. I'm doing, I'm like Nancy Drew. Yeah, that's the thing, you get so many clues, most of which are kind of pointless. So it's going to try and bamboozle and confuse me, you think? Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, it's already got you fairly confused, I'm assuming. Yeah, yeah, pretty much from the get-go, yeah. Oh, there's another prick. Oh, okay, oh. that one just seems to die. Oh, anxiety's already getting you. I'm such a fucking worse. I think that means basically you um, have a less steady aim and you might hallucinate now. Okay, so I could be hallucinating. So let's go through this door here. Yeah, this is going to be the big bastard that you have to kill. Uh, you can... I don't know... Oh, how do we swap ammo? Oh, uh, my bad. Just... What are you doing? What are you doing? That was my mistake. I was trying to change your ammo and I fucked up. Just just whack it. Twat it. Oh, oh. I left. Hang on. Leaving... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how... I can't hit it. There oh, we I'm are. hitting it, I'm hitting it, I'm hitting it. Yeah, just keep going with that. You'll get it. There we are. Fuck off. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, we might want to fiddle around and see how we change yeah, the... Yeah, because I've got, I've got a watery eye. Something got me right up the ring piece and then <laughs> the eye water. <laughs> <laughs> a syllable B D had many uses in the language of the ancients, not noticeably as the first symbol of the notorious dispel, purported to be a powerful enough to banish a god. So we've got the first of four initials to banish a god. And that's Patang, right? Pati. Oh, Pati, not Patang. Pati, not Patang. Okay, so let's get the fuck out of this place before we get shut up again. Which way do I go to leave? Down. And then all the way right. Okay. You're on, like, you're on like half sanity already, by the way. Uh, and unfortunately, Sasan um, sanity has um, no way of restoring it. Can't I have a little sleep or a Kit Kat? No. Oh. <laughs> the Kit Kats not do it? No. Kit Kats, when I'm feeling only... stressed at work, Kit Kats do it for me. <laughs> Like I said, the only way to gain some form of sanity back is to take drugs. <laughs> yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> the town folks are not immediately better off with the extermination of the creature behind their enslavement. There have been several murders and suicides, and murder suicides, and suicide murders. And double suicide murders. Already at the memories of their actions return. The best thing to do for them now is leave them to heal. From Basically, their suicide is kind of difficult. He's he showed up, fucked it all up, and now he's thinking, oh, I better get well, out of here. I don't know how you read here. Sharpish. Here. Before I fuck it up. So yeah, more. okay. Green circles means that they're basically merchant towns. You can buy things from them and buy services. Would that be a good idea? You don't really have that much cash, so I think you're fine for now. So shall I go down to four mouth? Four mouth, yeah. And obviously squares are um, objectives. So we need to get to Hobbiton. Hobbleton. Hobbleton. Hob Hob we need to get to Hobbiton. Gandalf's going to be there in ten hours. Um, <laughs> what are these weird black dot things all they're about? What, they're ones that you haven't discovered. Or what do you mean? Just coming up on the screen? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. just because you, you've lost sanity. It's making my eyes feel funny. How do I go down to Fawn Mouth? There we go, just click it. And then click it over here? Yep. Okay. Then drive. The 91 miles. How long would that take us in Euro Truck, normally? Uh, 91 miles? It depends. Are we having, like, three sleeps at a, <laughs> a port? And 84 days oh, later. I just wanted to say that I love you and I will support you to the end. I won't tell anyone where you've gone. Sanity! Oh, fantastic. Thank God for that. Now you don't have to take the drugs. <laughs> now I can put the drugs down. I came heart stopping. Oh, yeah, we have an event like this that happen every now and again. I come heart stoppingly closer, running over a person sprawled out in the middle of the street. They are clearly alive, judging by the way they shake and gibber violently. This is either a fresh possession by the shadow or someone in the throes of a comparatively ordinary illness. Can I watch him wait? Um, is that a good idea? You can do it, you can try to help him, it's up to you. I don't want to get my face bitten off. Like, it's well, I, I suppose if watch and wait means you just sit in the car. Let's so I hold back and watch callously as the man shivering slows to his stops. He isn't breathing. I wonder if I've made a mistake. Then, with a catch drunk noise, a spidery limb bursts from the poor man's chest. I was right not to go near, and I owe it to his memory to destroy the creature he becomes. So I'm going to fight this thing now. Yeah. Oh. It's just a spider. Oh. Oh, what? this weird little... It's, it's tumours on legs, Nathan. We might have to find out how to change the ammo. Yeah, you're going to want to pick them up. Oh, medicinal alcohol, which I merely put to use. Two uses. There's a dented old cash box here. Why was the tumour with legs carrying spare change? <laughs> he fancy, he fancy going to the tuck shop later on, did he? The, the, the monster tuck shop. The monsters uh, are dead. To buy the monster was, mash. Yeah, buy the monster mash. I was working in the lab late, late one, one night, night when my eyes beheld a 
weary sight that we would run out of mash. <laughs> and there is nothing more for me here. I returned to the car. I've wasted enough time. We could have just ran the fellow over and squashed the tumours with legs as we were going. It would have. It would have known. It would have known. Four maps. So you, know what, you can either enter the town and um, investigate, or you can go straight to Hobbleton. Um, Will there be anything for me here? Um, it looks like this is a place because I think when there's fog, it means that it's a dangerous place. Shall we have a look? I would say Hobbleton might be the, the best uh, idea. Yeah, okay, let's be doing that then. And then seven hours. I imagine that's that's so that that's how long I've got to get there. Yeah, we really need to find out how to change the. Uh, I think it might be either scroll or tab. Okay, well, next time you get to a dungeon, I'll let you hit tab and I'll let you hit scroll yeah. and we'll find out. Like I said, I don't want to use all my bullets up though. Oh, piss off. You need two things before heading to the Stonehenge the four part banishment spell and some idea of which god to banish. Technically, five things, I suppose. And that's from Mr. T. That's nice. Um, <laughs> Listen up, fool! <laughs> Listen up, fool! You need these to, to banish the demon! Um, <laughs> and B.A. Maracas! <laughs> B.A. Maracas! Oh, that's an inside joke from a that while was ago. so funny. I am brought to the problematic area and told that payments will be made once the problem is dealt with. Money is important because it can refill your med kit when you go to a safe town to buy medical supplies, and also it can um, buy you ammo and things. Okay, so I need that. Mm. I don't think the locals fully understand what kind of presence is in their town. It's the Jippos! But they showed much relief and gratitude. All right, calm down as with I that. I made my way inside. I'm just doing a you. We've got shout out in the pub. Um, <laughs> Shut up by that guy. <laughs> and then he was just having his on. Oh, right. It's not tab then. No. Where's Try scroll? S- oh, just scroll the mouse wheel. No. Oh no. Is it R? I don't know. E- what was that? E. E. It's E. It's E. Okay, e. that's good. It's, it's a good, good thing we didn't try O and R afterwards, isn't it? That would be O E O R R. Ching Jang Walla Walla Bing Bang. Ooh ee, ooh ah ah. Ching Jang Walla Walla Bing Bang. That's the song by the cartoons. Oh, that. that was back from the 90s, I want to say. Yeah, or was it 90s. early 2000s? That was the 90s. Pick up the fire be... extinguisher. Yeah, surely that would hurt the monsters. Yeah, they don't like foam, right? <laughs> foam party! I was more imagining you'd hit them with it. Oh, but... okay, I was going to spray them with the foam. I'm wandering around like an aimless tit. Yeah, ooh. ooh. Cat-like reflexes you got there. Thank you very much. There's I nothing just... in this room, it looks like. I just capped that fucking fool. <laughs> <laughs> we call Mr. T again. Oh, yeah, just so you know, hollow point rounds are more dangerous than um, nine mils, um, so they are a bit more valuable. Ooh. Oh, it went. Diddly. Yeah, that means there's a clue in there. We found some more about Batang. Uh, Bati. Bati. The walls of the cave were absolutely covered in the rune commonly pronounced as Bati. But among experts, pronounced Batang. You see, <laughs> that's what it's, that's what it's saying. Each one daubed on in a chalky orange paint by what I sincerely hope were human fingers. I've okay. had human fingers for me tea tonight. They were very nice. Um, <laughs> I had that Cadbury fingers. They were lovely. <laughs> right, so what does that mean Ooh. then? What, um, very little. So, very little. It's not <laughs> it's gonna a help monster, you, mate. though. In the long run, mate, that's not really going to help you, if I'm honest. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, it just means that... Because um, sometimes you find runes scrawled on walls. Help up in prison by the cult of Nyx. They locked me in a filthy... Oubliette. Oubliette. Mm-hmm. That's a French word. Did you learn that from um, the Count of Monte Cristo? I did, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear them cursing some enemy god, chanting shum. Shum? Shum. I shum. think they're all they're doing Star Trek evening. It's all the noises of the phasers. <laughs> shum, shum, shum. I, they didn't capsize the eye there. Yeah. I think they're killing people up there. Okay. God's uh, sake. Next is the enemy of the god identified by the shum rune. Okay, yeah, so eventually we're going to have to sort of look at that and like try and piece together a... Deduce who's yeah. what. Who Anything is what? in the plant pot? No. No. I've got the key, though. I've so, got one bullet left. Right, what now? Do we have to kill something or do we just have to get the... Bu- oh, I have to kill a thing. Do you point out it? Yeah, that's okay. your last bullet. <laughs> we're going to have to buy some ammo after this. Oh, piss. There we are. Maybe he's got bullets. If, no. If these new age types knew what... If, if those young'uns <laughs> knew what kind of forces they were toying with, I think that any anxiety they find is relieved by the Kazipati mantra would probably be cancelled out. It's like halfway along. Okay. You just basically start talking a weird new language. <laughs> and I don't get it. Like, you just start Uh-oh. going... Bzz, 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 bzz. I think you might be about to be chased by something. Oh. Chased? I'll just kill that thing. Never mind then. Fuck off, mate. Get there is fucked. a room you haven't ex- explored, but I'll tell you when you get there. Yeah? Should we yeah, have a look in that as well? It's, it's worthwhile looking in extra rooms. Yeah. Yeah, yeah because there could be more clues, more yeah, more bits and bobs you can use. Yeah, sometimes at the end of dungeons, when they're like a find the clue dungeon. What happened then? <laughs> the game's fucking with you, don't worry. 
You don't want to go right there. Um, yeah, there'll be like a, you. You just basically open a box and get a clue, and then it's then the word "run" just comes upon screen, and a oh, thing starts chasing you. No, can I sprint? Oh yeah, you hold shift. I forgot about that. Sorry. Oh, thanks for that. Um, the local folktale told to children concerns a cough, 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 or terror beast. Which that was one of the discontinued lines of Transformers. That terror which, beast. Yeah, it had like big spinning weird eyes, and it kept popping out on springs like the baddie from Blue Frame Roger Rabbit. <laughs> Um, you eats, mean Doc Brown? Yeah, and eats scared children. Well, I'm a scared child now. What if he comes to eat me? One wonders what the child is expected to do to avoid this fate. Not be scared? Okay, okay, okay. So, Kothoth hates a god associated with the colour white. Kothoth is the god of fear. Nyx is an ally of the god of fear. So, we can put that in the table. So, if we put um, God 2 as Nyx, um, and God 3 as Kothoth, Oh, he gone past it there. That. Okay. Uh, God, what did we say that their aspect was? He was fear. Kothoth, fear, yeah. Wasn't he? Fear, yeah. And um, they... Uh, he doesn't like white. He doesn't like Nick's white. Nick doesn't like white. Was that established? Do you want um, to go back to the clues? So, uh, Betty is orange... Kothoth hates the god associated with the colour white. Okay, so no, that's not... That's not it, okay. Nix is associated... Is an enemy of the god of the Shumrun. Again, a lot of this isn't really necessary. Okay, we get to we get to sort of clean it out later when we figure out that some of it's useless. Right, yeah. Then I'm not getting chased as well, which is always good. Oh, you're getting chased by that prick though. I'm just gonna run. Okay, sanity be damned. Sanity be damned. Damn my sanity! I'm just gonna make get the fuck out of here. Shifty, shifty. So you get you'll hopefully be paid handsomely. Good. Then I can buy a fuck. Can I buy a chainsaw? I think a chainsaw <laughs> will go down a storm here. Groovy. <laughs> <laughs> thirty-one pounds. Look at you rolling in the dough. It's it's all the Mars bars I've been eating. That's why I've gained thirty-one pounds. <laughs> <laughs> right. Anyway, let's crack on. R seven. R five. Fuck. I can't read military time. Just um, <laughs> the people waiting for me outside seem determined not to ask questions. Upon my assurance, the problem is resolved. They pay without quibble. Uh, I wonder if this will be the last time I visit this town. Right, in that case, can I pop to the door, bang around five minutes, go, yeah, all done, thirty-one pounds, please. That's right. Now you can. Um... You can probably buy things from these people. You can give them their money back. You can find supplies and visit a hospital, but you don't need to do that because you've got med supplies. So just um, I'm all right. find supplies, I'd say, because that's where you can get ammo. Okay. The following items on sale from individuals content, content not to ask questions. Cost uh, what? Definite... I, can, I can just fill up with all of them, can't I? I've got 31 quid, 50, 52 quid, so I can just fill up I, with all of them. Armour-piercing bullets are basically... I would save a little bit of money just for later. Armour-piercing bullets, basically, they go through enemies. So, so if like there's two. two if there's two enemies in a room, you can shoot two of them at once. Should we take, like, two of those? Yeah, I'd so say grab a couple of them. Um, toxic damage... Sure, why not? Because there are a few of them coming up. And you just equip that. Just by... Like yeah, that. Like that. Like that. Yeah, I and, got it. Uh, you're all sorted. I'd recommend you go back to the car with your 32 bonzers. Bonzer, mate. Right, right, now what do I do? I'd recommend going to Fourmouth. As you know, it's a dangerous town, and we're going to look for clues, Racky. We've just been there. Yeah, no, we're not, we've not explored it, though. Oh, okay, right, we just showed up, fucked up some monsters and left. That's fine. Yeah, we just sort of showed up, everyone was like, hooray, he's come to say, where the fuck is he going? Just pile the window down. <laughs> I'm back in about ten minutes, I'm just going to go down to Hobbiton. <laughs> Gandalf's going to be there, I've heard, he's brilliant. Um, <laughs> so that's what, that's Birmingham that's that's safe? That's nice to know. I've been to Birmingham, I wouldn't say the same <laughs> thing, but okay, if they want to say it's safe, then yeah, it's safe. Um, yeah, just in case anyone's not aware, all of these town names are made up. Mm. They're all, also all random. What, every time it's different towns? Yeah, well... That's well, a cool idea. Yeah. There is a short traffic jam on the motorway, not a major one. I should be moving again within minutes, but I take the opportunity to go out for a moment and stretch my legs. Other families have had the same idea. A couple are arguing around the car in front, and their young daughter, clad in pyjamas and a hastily thrown on coat, asks me if everything's going to be alright. Kill myself! <laughs> Why is it flashing kill myself? <laughs> because you've lost sanity. Now, basically, you have to time it so you don't kill yourself in front of this poor child. <laughs> Mister, is everything going to be all right? <laughs> is that a no? <laughs> well, he didn't say. He didn't. He didn't say yes. So he didn't say no. <laughs> so I'm taking that as a positive. <laughs> Do I be assuring or be honest? Um, if it's a little girl, I don't know. The parents might beat you up. I suppose if you try to reassure them. Just, just do it. There, I got it. I pretend to have misunderstood the question and tell the girl that her parents are arguing over nothing. It doesn't mean they love each other any less. She nods slightly puzzled and leaves me alone. Shortly afterwards, traffic starts moving and the family go on their way. I wonder how differently this encounter could have gone. So I should have been honest. 
I don't know. I don't, don't know. know. Oh, okay. With, with, the, with the little girl I said, oh, can I borrow your gun, please? <laughs> Should I do you than do me? The little girl would say, just put us both out of our misery. <laughs> the shadow has a definite foothold in goring. It's got a definite armhold in, in, in Abba Stanwith as well. Well, of course something bad happened in goring. Yeah, exactly. The name like, like goring. It's all right. I heard there's, there's rumblings in the town down the road, Death Dams United, <laughs> that it's all kicking off down there as well. Is that where Stabbington Lakes is? Yes. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> There's some extra cash in it if you're willing. Well, cash is all right for us, I think. Oh, yeah, I will say, sometimes texts are bad. You'll get a text from an unknown number. You can get texts from unknown numbers. Yeah. And sometimes it'll be like, hey, man, I heard what you're doing. That's awesome. Here, have ten pounds. Yeah. And sometimes it'll be like, I'm going to tear off your fucking legs. And then you lose sanity. What, in the same text message? Here's ten pounds. <laughs> By the way, I'm going to tear off your fucking legs. <laughs> it could happen. It could happen. <laughs> Reports have reached me of mysterious pests rising up from oh, the ground. Oh, it's never go in a place and kill everything. A numerous one. place. They attack randomly, killing cats, stealing food. Oh, that's it. I'm just to revenge the cats. Dick. Uh, and injuring people. I'm going to revenge the food. It's just the first sprouting seed of a total... of <laughs> revenge the food. Um, the <laughs> seed of total invasion by the shadow. It starts with petty nuisances, killing pets and ruining crops. Sooner or later, it escalates missing people being found half... Well, not missing, then, are they? They've been found half devoured. Well, half of them's technically missing. It was roots out the nest before it reached... <laughs> so should we go and do that, then? Yeah. Yeah? A grammar school. Yeah, they're places of evil. Yeah. That's, that's damn right. <clears throat> Several witnesses pointed me to the grammar school, which was the first building to be shut down for infestation. But the place is secure enough that I doubt the creatures could be spawning there unnoticed. However, the school records led me to a teenager who had been working on some kind of science project... So he did it. He right. was the one who summoned the Dark Lord. I'm going to pop him in the back of his skull. <laughs> he lived with his parents in a nearby oh, suburb, those... smack in the middle of an evacuated zone. The house me might be worth investigating. Those are the ones you want to watch out for. Still live with their parents. Find and destroy a nest. Okay, I've not got any bullets. Hang on. E. Yeah, there yeah, you go. got your nine now mils I've got, my, I've got my nine mils, baby. Grandfather clock. That's creepy. This is going to be a big house, isn't it? Like, how big is this house? Um, it's going to be like several blocks. Why? Why do they live in such a big fancy house? And if he lives in a big fancy house, why is he conjuring up evil spirits? Well, he goes to a grammar school. I suppose you just sort of do that for entertainment in between, like, the wanks of a snuff film. <laughs> you just do that for a laugh, do you, after a while? <laughs> right, well, I killed that thing. You yeah, bastard. That door's a prick. Come back here. I'm going to go right through you, my friend. <laughs> right, Whether you look- fucking like it or not. <laughs> oh, could there be a thing? Uh, while not their signature colour, the god Nyx is also shown to have an affinity for the colour orange. Ah, okay, so orange would be the colour of Kathoth. Okay, so can we can we put that into the little yeah, table go that I'm working table. from? So Kathoth, he's the ah, colour Ah, so that means orange. also know their rune, because there was a rune associated with the colour orange, wasn't so let's there? Let's go back to that. It was uh, the Petit rune. Does that, does that get rid of him, or does that like... Basically, if, if he is the invading god, we know what rune to use for him. However, we are still questioning whether or not he is invading, or whether he's just allied, or whether he's not even fucking involved at all. Okay. All right. Okay. Got it. Base. Oh no! What's that? Another victim of the shadow. The poor wretch seems to have used their own blood to down but abstract abstract symbols and strange phrases all over the surrounding floor. It says, "Help me! I'm dying." (laughs) No one will ever be able to decipher this. The big, this big monster thing came in, fucked up all my shit. Worshippers consider it a grave insult to draw Chizo's symbol in red, as this is the colour associated with one of their oldest and bitterest rivals among the ancients. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, we're getting a lot of clues now. You can um. There's nothing else in there, I suppose. There's a locked door. We don't have any keys yet. Because apparently this family doesn't leave their keys lying around in the <coughs> cupboard, which is rude. Hey, there we are. Now we can access the entire building. And this, again, it's quite a big house. Yeah, like... And no beds. Yeah, like, and no, no toilets. It's just all hallway. <laughs> yeah, no loose. Where do they go to the loo? Um, Three armour-piercing bullets. This is a good thing you didn't really get that much. Oh, what a dick. Oh, that one's a bigger... There we are, you got him. Right. I found a small portable first aid kit. Ah, oh, that's nice. That's very handy. I'm glad so this that is going monster, quite well for you at the moment. That monster, I'm glad that monster was carrying first aid supplies. Um, you've gone invisible. Why have I gone invisible? Sanity, bro. What, does that... Does my sanity mean that I go invisible? Yes. <laughs> Except the monsters can obviously sit in... T- you made sure of that one, didn't you? <laughs> right. I'm going to go this way now, then. You're running it low on ammo for that one, so be on the red... Just tell me when to okay. change your ammo, because this might be the boss man. Yeah, oh. Change me up. Oh, you got armor pissing. Armor pissing? Armor pissing. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to kill that one at all. There we are. Jump. 
jobs are good. My recording device picked up the chanting of some kind of mantra intended to ward off evil. It was hard to make out, but the second part definitely sounded like a kuz. That's nice. A kazoo, maybe. There we are. Okay, well, there's um, another door down there, so if you want to investigate that... Should we have a look at that? Yeah, might as well. I think that's a good idea. Yeah, you know, it might Uh, be... What the fuck is that thing? I don't know. It's, um... Oh, what? Okay, so when the monster fucks off, it also damages your sanity. How rude of the monsters. I know, right? It didn't hang around to have a nice, kind of, nice fight with me, (laughs) did it? It just just ran away. Right, so I need to go, what, like, through this... Oh, those things. They're horrifying. What are they? That, well, that was just a hallucination, thankfully. But those are basically like saw blades that hang from the wall that chase you. I'm okay. getting my shit kicked in here. In a pile of useless metal implements, I found a small tool that could function as a lockpick. Not a chainsaw. Can we get a chainsaw? <laughs> the patient has become irrationally terrified of the current orange. Oh, to the point that absolutely no progress is being made. I am wearing any garment of orange. A change of medication may be in order. Okay, so hang on, go down, see what that means, because I thought... Oh, well, we've already associated that with fear, haven't we? Yeah, so orange, scary. Yeah, so Kathoth is scary orange. Scary. He's a big, scary orange motherfucker. He's like, like the annoying orange. He's like a big, big evil Cheeto. He's <laughs> just coming right at you. <laughs> evil Cheeto, that's my new indie band name. <laughs> right, how do I oh, You want to go here? up there, to the left. Up there? Yeah. Okay, I'll get a bit lost in these dungeony bits. And head head right. Just head right, yeah. Yeah, we should be okay. Though. We're not going to get like fucked, t- like shit kicked in by any more monster, anything, are we? No. Uh, well, apart from that one. Piss off! Get out of it! Oh, you gained some ammo. Yeah, I'd recommend when you, um, if in danger, you can escape. Oh yeah, you can escape dungeons quickly. But what's the downside? Oh, uh, you lose an hour. Lose an hour. Which at the moment time isn't. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Time isn't that sort of um, desperate for you, so it might be an idea to do that, but as long as you've collected everything you can. Yeah, I'm sorry if it's it's doing anyone's eyes in. It's (laughs) doing my eyes in at the minute. The creatures still infest every crack and shadow of the town, so we did nothing, basically. But I've ensured they will no longer breed. A combined effort by the locals will be enough to exterminate the remainder. I can move on. Talk about doing half a job. Like, he shows up just half a job. I'd go left and heal yourself, because you're looking a bit... Beaten up. You're looking a bit peaky there. Bit peaky blinders! (laughs) You have sailed your uniforms. <laughs> right, Set so destination. That's... Okay, do you want to try and make it to Goring? I don't know if you have enough time, honestly. I've got seven hours. Well, should we go... Because I've got a bit of cash. Should we go there and get some more bullets? Yeah, go, go, go Hobbleton and see if we can make it to Goring. And then, Yeah, let's see if we can make it there. Yeah. And then, like I say, in that case, what we could do is we can get some more bullets from that place as well. Yeah. Yeah. I don't expect a reply from this. I'm not going to sit and fret about whether you will. Just stay safe and maybe one day we'll see each other again. Oh, some sanity for you. Oh, that's nice because I needed some of that. Yeah. To be fair, it's weird backwards this game because in my life, my family reduced my sanity. <laughs> Especially with text about how much they love you. Yeah. So it's nice uh, It's nice that in this game it works all the way around. Um, yeah. So do you want to... Oh, oh, yeah, hey, hey, hey steady hey, there. Yeah, I was about to click it. Yep, yeah, beautiful, we'll do that. Right. Oh, if, if you if you click kill yourself, there is a chance to stop yourself. So just just click it. Not Hang on. Now, now, now. There, there we, we go. Are. Found the following items on self from an individual ask, not asking questions. There we go, get some more of those in. And then... Any armour piercings you want, really. Let's take two of those. Okay. Wait. Hey, steady on there. And now go. Yeah. I'm okay. getting good at this. Okay, now set my destination. Yeah, you've got four hours to get to Gorin. You should be fine. I should be fine. It's Gorin. Enemy operation found. Drive. Now, those buttons will never start saying kill myself, will they? No, they okay, won't. thank God for that. It's only those little menu bits. Thank God for that. Oh, for fuck. I found a small... I found myself outside a small garage that appears to still be operating. The owner, a stocky and oddly haunted fellow... There we are, we already explained what was wrong with him. <laughs> explained that since the shadow fell, he saw it as his duty to make sure people get to where they, they need, need to be. need to be. No. Yeah, that's... No, thank you. He was impressed by setting my car, considering, and has offered to boost the engine's top speed if I can spare him two hours and 15 pounds. No, thank you. I don't want to do that. Yeah. I'm waiting for it to kill myself again. Wait. Now go. Oh, what? Click, 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 click. Oh, that's, that was sneaky. Ooh. <laughs> Excuse me, do you mind if I fix up your car? <laughs> <laughs> right, can I go now? It's not yeah, go, go. Is it? That was shitifying. I didn't like that. Oh, yeah, they're just telling us at the place we've... Ju- Why don't we say hello? Yeah, we just, we just passed. No, don't talk to me now, I'm busy. <laughs> Maybe that's who we bought the bullets from. <laughs> don't talk to me now, I'm busy. Just just, just text me later about it, alright? Yeah, I made it to Goring, enter the town. I am brought to the problematic area until the payment will be made once the problem is dealt with. I don't think the locals fully understand what kind of presence is in their town, but I, they showed much relief in the gratitude as I made my way inside. 
Wonderful. Was that fast enough for you? Beautiful. Dimensional rift? And see it with an incantation? We don't have an incantation for that. Don't go back to the car. I'm just going to just go back to the car. <laughs> just, just run away. <laughs> it's like that scene from Casper. <laughs> like, you're just like, hey, I'll go fix a problem. We'll do so. Walk in and run out to things. I can't do I it. I can't do it. Like, we don't know the incantation. I'm sure we'll find it in the room. Oh, there we are. Uh, there is a dented old cash box. I don't need money. I need spells. <laughs> I need wizarding spells. I need... I need... Where's Gandalf? <laughs> I thought Gandalf was an hobbiton, but I must have missed him. Oh, dear. Um, I'm sure we'll find it in this room. That will just guess it and lose all of our sanity. Why not? Why not? We're halfway hey. there already. Yeah, we're halfway to mental. Um... <laughs> a set of keys. Oh, so that's I'm nice. I'm going to go back the other way then. Just check out the um, You could have just... like Because those two rooms are connected. Oh, but, can you do it that way as well? Yeah. I'm such a bad hand. All right, it's fine. We'll go this way. I say, sometimes you won't find a door there because of poor architecture, but a lot of the time you'll be fine. Uh, the carving dates back to the 6,000 BC. Kavoth defeating and casting out of figure labelled the God of Pain. It appears to have been intended as an insult to a rival faith. Okay. Does that mean much to us? Um, not really. We don't really know who's the rival of Kavoth yet. You're basically like my spirit guide at the minute, Nathan. Like, I'm... Doing all the moving. Oh no. Their limbs drawn up and their hands covering their face. Just you mean their hands stopped being real and started being animated? <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> I get it. I get that joke. Thank well you. done, Blake. I'm desperately trying to block out the nightmare around them. It was it was um, Peter Andre and Katie Price's version of A Whole New World. But that they're started, not together anymore. Why would they still sing that? That started playing never endingly on the speakers and they just went mad. <laughs> There is some kind of survivalist cache containing three hollow point rounds. See, that's 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 what I like to see. Ammo. Was, it's the I real currency of the world. Just about to say I love America, but it's not America. No, this, this is this is Britain. Britain. We're in England and sometimes Scotland and Wales. I've been that way, haven't I? Yeah, you can go left. Okay, let's go left then, mate. Is this where the rift? Scotland that's the rift. Okay, so oh, that's why. No, you have to go there. We have, I have to go there. Yeah, because um, okay, I see that that's the rift. You have to. That's the spell you have to do. So it's those two symbols, whatever they are. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There's a what thing was coming at you. What was uh-oh? I don't know. Hang on. Um, what are those rooms? Oh, yeah, just kill that thing. I don't know what the rooms are. Fucking hell. Hang on. Nathan, can you switch the bullets for me? Oh, yeah. You have to ask, you know. You switch me, switch me. Damn it, Blake. Shoot the things. They're all coming out of me. Don't what do I do? Hit them. Oh, there's another one there. Oh, a lot! You gained a lockpick from it, though. They're all coming out. I mean, yeah. I okay, well, I'm, to I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to go ahead with it. Hang go on. ahead, just go for it. Sorry. Yeah, what? I got. Why is there not? Okay, was that right one? I don't know. I did it. Okay, right. Kill these bastards with your fists. I'm such a badass. <laughs> yeah, now go get that other one before he knocks seven shades of shite out of you. Oh, There's other more. two. Sorry. It's not, well, I did what I could, Blake. I think you might be about to lose it. Uh, okay, yeah, that's not particularly helpful. What? <laughs> We've lost it. Oh, oh no, I died. Never mind, eh? You did well. Did I do all right? I think you did quite well, considering it was your first go at it. Should we go again? Yeah, do you want to... We've got time for another one. Do you want to play again? Yeah, if you want... Yeah, if yeah. you don't mind, yeah. Like I said, I've never... I do? Had... Ending G, dead. Yeah, that's that's true. Yeah. I did die. Um, what's that birth star about? Um... Ooh. Uh, files. Oh, files. We, oh, yeah, we got 2.29% on that. That basically tells us about the monsters we saw. Carver, oh, okay. Spitter, Scuttler, Worker Buzzer, Soldier Buzzer, Bertha, and Floater. I used to know Bertha. I used to go to school with her. <laughs> Bertha. B-E, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I thought that was some sort of joke about how someone's had so many babies. Oh, no, 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 no. I was just, well, some of the ladies we some went to school the, with. Some of, most of them. I've, I've dropped kids. Um, <laughs> Too many kids. Whoa, that's a bit weird. Hang on, something made me check patterns in the rooms. I don't know why, but I'm glad I did. A massive synchronisation is coming, centred on Stonehenge in roughly 60 hours. But it's a new date now. Yeah, oh, no, the date changes each time. Oh, okay. For some reason, I cannot shake a sensation of deja vu. Ah. I have memories of assembling a ritual, fleeing through darkened hallways, and firing a gun. Not very well, I might add, because yeah. my aim's shy. <laughs> at something unimaginable. I feel like some distant part of me may have died this way. So is this like alternate universe, or is it just like repeated lives? Like Groundhog Day, but they're aware of it. I don't know. That's very interesting. Yeah. That's very interesting. Oh, you get to choose a birth star. Basically, these are, um, you know, it's kind of like Skyrim. Oh, awesome! Okay, what do we want then? What have we got? Well, I don't know. Sanity, medkit capacity. I don't. I don't think you can like start at the top though. 
Do we just have to take one like the serpent, the lion? Yeah, I suppose so. So it just lock pick chance. I don't think is very important. No. Like med kit capacity, nah. Serpent sanity and med kit capacity that might be important. What have we got over here though? Magician, random spell. Which I wouldn't random spell anyway. Health always good. Priest down here, no. I've got health and health, research. random spell and research. I don't get why it's ticking over though. Because I think it depends on like where you are. But I think if you just click it, it will just like um, start you at the bottom. Okay, shall we just do that then? Yeah. For extra Try, health. Just, yeah. Do you want to click it? There we are. As in each time you go through, you get a new one of those then. Yeah. You level up. Yeah. Interesting. Cursed towns are the best place to find what you're looking for. Old Gate would probably be your best place to start. I've just seen that as well. Yeah, don't, don't look, look back. back. That's quite nice. Do you know why? Why? Because your dead wife's in the back seat. <laughs> so, Nathan, I thought after we got rid of the body, we'd stop talking about that. <laughs> the, the, the memory haunts me, Blake. I mean, proper up in the back I'm seat. I'm having nightmares and waking nightmares and living nightmares. <laughs> proper up in just the all seat. nightmare all the time. <laughs> To, uh, to keep using the carpool lane, I thought it was rather insensitive. But other than that, we were all right. Um, sleep is in Somalia. I was a long way from here. I can't get there in, in, in hour, three hours. In three hours. <laughs> by right. car. By an, your old Ford Escort. <laughs> well, if you saw the uh, the crazy spooky bloke, he would have upped the car for me. I feel a crackling in the depths of my inner ears. Oh, thank God he said ears. And the backs <laughs> of my palms are itching. That's because you've been wanking too much. All of which indicates the presence of magical energy. Does and it? wanking. What does it indicate wanking? Um, there is a great concentration of it. That's concentrated. That, that, that has, has a... <laughs> Well, yeah, because you need to get it done before it disperses. Fortunately, what can be what can be opened by the same corrosive energies can be closed. Oh, we've got, we got, we got another rift to deal with. This came, made us come unstuck last time. Yeah. Casting magic has its difficulties, but tracing it is straightforward enough. I feel like I need to write down yeah, like, what the runes are. Yeah, but... while I'm firing like a fucking cowboy in there. Yeah, so um, I'll see... does his pen work? Divinations lead me to a fairly newly built community college, or their places of evil, of course, on the border where the commercial district meets the suburbs. Another case of students messing with powers they don't understand. Yes. I steal myself to enter. Do you think Croshaw hates students? Do you think he hates is? the English language? <laughs> okay, so bear with me. It's my. Oh, oh no, go to... hang on, I'm going to go to tab. Ah, that makes things easier. Okay. That's fine, okay, but in that case I don't need to write anything down. So we've got enough time. It's because I was clicking like a madman then that yeah. fucked us over. Okay. Well, no, no, it's more because I didn't know that I had to hit tab to do the spell. I was just pressing number one and two ah. and hoping it works. Ooh, this is interesting. The Shumrun has been inscribed on the wall here in red. A generic prayer to a god. Not necessarily the god prevent- perverting this place with his dick. <laughs> it could be intended for an associated deity. Basically an ally of perhaps... Basically red, and that symbol is associated with the god who is friends with the god who's invaded. They're like bosom buddies. They, they go bowling Oh, you missed, you, you missed a monster in the... Don't go back, you dick! I wanted to fuck the monster. Where's the monster then? I don't know, he's gone now. Oh, he's scarpered, has he? Yeah. Bastard. As he bloody well should after seeing you walking around with a gun. <laughs> so, shum again. Shum, yeah. shum, shum. Beautiful. Nothing else to see here. No, you're going to have to go all the way up. Okay, let's be doing that. Oh, there. there's a prick there. Where? There. Oh, should I turn this up for you? No, no, that's fine. I can hear it well. I'm fine okay. enough. It's just I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> um, that's, that's what's going to get me killed. Yeah. Okay, so I can go uppity uppity and then lefty lefty. Especially if it's the god of attentiveness that's <laughs> So I'll go up. Uh, all up. Brief. Yeah. Briefcase. Filing cabinet. Um, Nick's defeating and casting out the like, god these of pain. these change each time as these well? These change each time, yeah. Oh, so we've lost all of our clues from last time. Shit. God of pain is so... Nyx is the enemy of the god of pain. That's fine. Is that all right? We're happy yeah. with that. I'm going right. to confuse myself when I'm seeking this later, because I'll say that, and then that'll pop up. And I think, wait, that's really out of sync now. <laughs> Don't worry, Nathan, of the future. I've got your back. <laughs> A patient has become irrationally terrified of the colour white. <laughs> Thankfully. Never, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> <laughs> so I wasn't, I'm not going to continue that joke. <laughs> to the point that absolutely no progress can be made. I don't know. Is it racist to say, thankfully, I'm black? <laughs> 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 so we're all right. We're all, there's a note on there. Nah. Oh, hang on. No, no, we'll go back in. We'll go back in. Yeah, we never actually checked that diary page on last time. That might have been useful. A small diary page. Oh, that's yeah. number two. Yeah. So let's, so let's check that out when we get back, yeah? Yeah. Okay. I think you can check it in the car. Do we get keys? We got keys. We got keys. We okay. got keys for days, baby. Okay, so I'm going to try and do the ritual. So it's um, so that's going to be one and three. Pap! That's that close. Did you get it? Yeah. You genius! Now I know how to do this easily. <laughs> I don't. I didn't know what you had to do. 
Basically, the symbols that appear, uh, the symbol shum uses in the language of the ancients, most notably as the first symbol of the notorious dispel. So basically, that's the first uh, symbol of the enchantment spell. Okay. Okay. That's brilliant. By the escape, fuck, run. But just keep running forward. Yeah. But I'll lose, I'll lose sanity if I leave a room with You're going to have to. I'm going to have I can't this kill is this like, one. No. Okay. Out the fucking way, dick. Wait, is escape the same as run? I'm not sure. It could just mean well, there's going to be monsters. We've got we're on a, we're on the clock here. Let's yeah. just leg it. Yeah, let's just get shifted. Time on. to move on. Uh, okay, so town is not immediately improved. Well, it's called Old Gate, so any more than a flood zone would be simply because the rain had stopped. Yeah, because you've got to like get all the water snakes and business out of there. But my contribution is made. You got to you got to get uh, David Cameron trumping about in his wellies, like <laughs> over and done with. <laughs> While he walks around pretending to be sympathetic. Yeah. Go to Sommel, there's a job there. Oh, back up Northern. here. Northern. Northern. It doesn't mean you're going to have to like, traipse back through like ruined old old gate. But money oh, well. is money. Money is money, mate. You're right. We need some money to buy some more bullets. How much How much money do you think it is to be like a paranormal investigator? I don't know. Like, yeah, probably that's an easy job, isn't it? Like Someone calls you, I think my house might be haunted. You walk and say, yeah, it's haunted. Yeah. Well, can you get rid of it? I don't know. Good costume. I've not got the right parts. It's going to take me a few weeks to get them, you know. <laughs> because that's the best con ever, surely. Yeah. There's a thing I can't see in, uh, that I think might be in the house. Oh, it's definitely in your house, yeah. That'll yeah. be £100, please. And then that, that'll that somehow help. The large creature bewitching this town. The ghost is telling... Sam, Sam, <laughs> Sam. The ghost is telling me. You know the to- large creature that's disrupting this town? It's not Gemma Collins, is it? She's quite a big lady. Who? The lady is in CBB this year. CBB? Celebrity Big Brother. Oh, I don't watch that tap. Oh. <laughs> Are you watching that tap? No, I just know who Jelly Collins is because she reminds me of all those. You know those. You know in Fantasia? You know that bit where yeah. the hippos dance with the crocodiles? <laughs> she just reminds me of those. Every time I see her, I just think hippos dancing with crocodiles. I don't know why. Um, is she ever with a crocodile? No. Well, she's, David Guest. She's just a great big fat lady. Yeah. So, oh, did you see the one speaking about that paranormal activity? That that thing you would Sarah call yeah. her. There was one where he was talking to an old lady called Mary, and her husband was called Richard, which resulted in him shouting, "Mary loves dick" for about ten yeah. minutes. Mary, I, think I saw that one. Mary loves dick. <laughs> In the language of the ancients, the name Nyx is often associated with a symbol representing a stick man with the head and one arm missing. So not a stick man, then? No. It's sort of... It's, um... Uh, oh, hang on. Go on. Uh, so it would be... Oh, that one. Cuz. Cuz. Just because. I have recovered some dusty jewellery. I sm- <laughs> What jewellery is that? <laughs> I'll be taking that bargain on next week. <laughs> <laughs> I've got, like, no fucking bullets, Nathan. Oh, you don't, though? No, That's I right. don't know. We'll, we'll go shopping after this. Go shopping for bullets. We'll dip down Lidl and get some discount <laughs> wine mills. I'm out of wine, Blake. I don't know what to do with myself. <laughs> I did bring the bottle in. Oh, what the fuck? That's, that's horrible. That's, that's a vomiter, I think it's called. Or a... Why is he stuck to the ceiling? Because he's a prick. There we are. That got rid of him. Don't be afraid of the dark little one. Speak out loud in these words and the shadows will be lifted from your eyes. oop dee oop dee If I start going home and start doing this, Grandma's going to get the priest round. <laughs> he's been possessed. He keeps that, bang- Yeah, he's definitely haunted. It'll be hundred pounds, please. <laughs> he, ke- he keeps banging on him. Like, he keeps going, batang and oop I don't okay, know what's so happening to him. Ret- I'm just going to ch- double check what that spell does. Well, so, ip-dee. dark vision. So, I'm assuming it gets it like improves your um, sight there. How do I get back out again? Just keep going left, yeah? Uh, yeah, there is a room you haven't investigated. Do you want to just leave or? No, no, no. no. We've got we've got plenty of time. No, no, no. I'm not saying that way. No, no. But I'm thinking. What are you on. doing, man? I don't know. I'm going this way. That's the way. I'm just. That's how you gonna... lose sanity. Go left. I'm going to go this way. That's the way I'm going. Oh and then dear. Up, yeah. Yeah. Up then. Oh. Hang on. Let's fuck him up. I don't know whether he can go. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> like kind of a, an old like, motorcycle. <laughs> like a sexy motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we are. Right, anything of interest here up here, game? Absolutely nothing. All. But I can just keep going down now, can't yeah. I? And then go left. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, there's a prick. So, do you see how important sanity is? Yeah, yeah. I should have, like, Dr. Crippen, the acid bath murderer. Um, <laughs> Which which is not a good time for anybody, if I'm no. honest. Well, that's some nice hollow points you got there, Blake. I've got a very nice collection of hollow points, haven't I? Yeah. 
Have you, have you named them? No, not yet. I was hoping they'll be like the ones from Roger Rabbit, where like one's like a Mexican and one's like a cowboy, and you fire them, they're like, yeah. You, you got bullet. Well, fair enough, you know. It's always good to conserve ammo. I've got. I think I've got the pattern of these fuckers. Yeah, also, anyway. those ones don't. They didn't seem to do much. That one just sort no. of like went with your punches. It was just sort of like, oh hello, it's nice to boom. Oh, it's fun, boom. But it's, 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 can I just have a? <laughs> do you mind? <laughs> have you got time to talk about our Lord and Savior? Kafufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufufuf
Is that his name, Trilby? Well, yeah, because um, I think it was mentioned in the uh, thing that so that's what he means by the letter T, because that's one of his other characters that he, he likes to use a lot. Ah, uh, okay. <clears throat> so stop briefly at a junction, a harassed-looking young woman. Oh dear, young man. Young man. Oh god, that's me being sexist again. <laughs> in rumpled clothing, runs to my window. Please don't ride between laboured breaths. Well, it I'm must just... be a woman who's going into labour. <laughs> I was going to make a joke about how I disagree with his political alignment, but... <laughs> you want smart. I like that one. We'll go with that one. Edit mine says... out. Put, your, put yours in. Um... He says that there are dark forces at work in one of the safe towns and it's vitally important he get there. His hands, his hand is nervously rattling at my passenger side door handle, which I've shrewdly been keeping locked. Basically, he's desperate to get in, but for what reason? Do we let him in? That's up to you, Blake. This is your I game. Want, I don't want to do it. I want to leave him. But what if it like it's a bad idea? What if he is telling the truth? Well, if he if if he is a bad one, it will basically mean you might lose a bit of health and you might lose a bit of sanity. But if he's not... a good one, then what? If he's a good one, you have to drive somewhere and he might give you some money or a clue. Basically, I reckon personally, um, the reward is greater than the risk. Okay, let's try it. The man almost collapsed with gratitude in my passenger seat and asked me to head head for Bill's Row. Ah, you see, it looks like it was a good idea. So Excellent. you can't look at him because that's filled with your illegal drugs. Pissing out nine hours. Um, he's, he's he's taking the piss. He is. <laughs> <laughs> he's just gonna say, "Come on, <laughs> calm the just, fuck down." So you start going. 100 bottles of beer on the wall, 100 bottles of beer. <laughs> Did I ever tell you about that time I killed a man? <laughs> oh, God. Did you want to drink my water? Oh, yes, please. Don't tell you I've got dysentery. <laughs> oh, it's Clements from, from Organ Trail. <laughs> I've got sights of enemy minions in some all that need exterminating. There's some extra cash in it for you if you're willing. I've got to get to fucking wherever we're going. Kidforth. I've got to uh, get to Bill's Road in seven s- hours. Go saxing. I'm really good at saxing. The ladies <laughs> love it. <laughs> As in the uh, instrument, yes? Yes, I'm really good. My mum won't let me buy a trumpet. Why not? Because she says it's too noisy. You can I'm, keep it here. And I'm not allowed to have one. Been rolling my cyanide pill around my mouth all morning. What if I should bite it? It tastes like one of those chewable vitamins. So he's... he's Fucking chewable. Calm down, man. He's getting, like, edgy. That's, like, too edgy for he's, you. He's not, he doesn't trust you. That's the problem. There's not enough trust in this ministry of occultism. <laughs> hey. who, who'd have thunk it that, that there'd be a lack of trust in the ministry of occultism? <laughs> rude, I say, rude. <laughs> Quite frankly, it's just it's just not on. <laughs> oh, for, oh, who have we hit now? <laughs> is that going to be your reply if you actually did hit someone ever in real life? Oh, who are we hit now? Oh, not again. What sort of inconsiderate arsehole has just let themselves be hit by my car? I'm starting to full awakeness with something heavy and fleshy slams into my front bumper. Ooh. I stop the car on a Sounds reflex. Sounds sexy. <laughs> the unmoving mass in the road could be human Ooh. or animal. Anxiety seizes my heart. Okay, the issue with this one is if you find out what you hit, it could attack you. If you drive on, you could like feel real guilty and get anxiety. You've got anxiety. Yeah, it sounds awfully <laughs> sexy. Something heavy and fleshy. Yeah, you're walking around a dungeon, like surrounded by spider beasts with a gun, and you're having it. I don't think my girlfriend likes me. <laughs> <laughs> Should we find out what I hear? Um, I don't know because I think I did this once, and it took me to somewhere completely different in the country. I'd be worried about the passenger if that happened. Okay, let's just drive on then. Let's yeah. get, we've got to. We've got to get there. Uh, except by doing so, I'm already thinking about it. The more I try not to think about it, the more I continue to think about it. My hands are shaking, and you lost sanity. Oh well. Who needs sanity in a place like this? <laughs> Bills Row. Enter town. There we are. Something seems off about my passenger. He steps out of the car without saying a word. A strange stiffness to his movements. On a hunch, I follow him, and he leads me to a part of town that virtually drips with foreboding. He meets with an indistinct entity under a hooded robe, and both vanish. Whatever my passenger's mission one, I suspect the shadow's influence has sub- subjugated it. It falls to me, then, to conclude this matter. So I'm going to pop my new friend in the head. Basically. Oh, a nest. Oh, good. Are these, are these annoying? These, well, it's what you found before. Basically, it means there's going to be creatures spawning creatures. Mm. All can hurt you and everyone's angry. I'm just going to go through this hole in the garden fence. Ooh, a bin. Go rummaging. I thought I heard the boom. Yeah, that means... Monsters. No, 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 that means rummage. Oh. Oh, a set of keys. That's that's nice and quick for you. That's lovely. Ooh, a bin. Ooh, a bin. There's lots of bins in this part. It's a half-thrown-away Big Big Mac. (laughs) Oh, lovely. Um, Gained health. Lost sanity. I just fucking clocked that thing. Did you see that? I was like, pow, pow. I was impressed. You were like John Rambo. <laughs> I was like, I just turned into um, Dirty Harry for a minute then. <laughs> the dirtiest of Harrys. Oh, you missed a clue. Oh, is that what the other thing is? Yeah. Tell me where a clue is. Is that this? No, left. No, left. Probably a bin. Yeah, there Oh, it's are. a bin. Um, 
<laughs> oh, more nine mil bullets. That's Who nice. throws their gun away in the trash? <laughs> what if the bin men picked that up and actually shot themselves in the chin? <laughs> like what the, then? They're like, oh, you might want to check out that rune. Uh, upside down, intended to be a curse of the god that's associated with the rune. We found no clues about the god so far, by the way. Yeah, we yeah. We found the nest. <laughs> How do I shoot this roof. thing up there? Just click it. Oh, hang on. No, I step back. E. Oh, sorry, I didn't. You've got to be telling me these things, Blake. I saw it. I got him. I got him. Survivalist cash more. Oh, oh, shit. No. <laughs> <laughs> that poor statue. Uh, I, I got a bit twitchy. Reptile chain and treatment seem far too effective to entirely... Uh, okay. So you found a healing spell. That's that's good. And that's Angbadur. Angbadur. <laughs> Sounds like you're spitting tobacco. <laughs> That's yeah, that hits the yeah, the spittoon yeah. on the way down. Um, that was like a whole mess of a screen. Oh, sorry, that was that that movement, man. Yeah, do you see that whole mess of a screen there? Yeah, like, it all went crazy. Like there was loads of stuff. I can get. A sh- you sh- want to go up? You missed one. Oh, I missed one. Yeah. So we're thinking exploration is key. Always best to explore lots yeah. and lots. Just to oh. fuck off, mate. Oh, I'm gonna swap you over to you. Oh no, wait. I'm, I'm just gonna swap this one. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. And what? Yeah, you actually started this one off with less time as well. I only gave you 60 hours. Do you sometimes get more? Yeah, usually three days. Three, four days, which is 72. Uh, yeah, you're right. Man. Yeah. Uh, the shum no 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 Yeah, we've had this one before, I think. So, uh, I'm assuming that shum is an enemy of, um, buddy. Or that, that... He's speaking in weird, crazy... That round one again. with a spike through it. Ooh, Let's get a I ran straight <laughs> and killed it with my. And I ran, I ran into that fly. <laughs> I killed it with my manly chest. I was about to chest bump it. <laughs> Boom! Um, right. Okay. I emerged to find the town still slumbering peacefully, unaware of how narrowly it escaped subjugation by nightmares. It is small thanks, but for now, I think sufficient. <laughs> I feel quite buoyed by the clean air. Oh, that's nice. Do you want to find some supplies? You started doing it again. Yeah, you're getting low on your sanity there. Uh, precious hour. Oh, a flashlight. That's always useful. I'm going to take that. Yeah, basically it, m- it means your screen is less dark from now on. How did I do it last time? Just way? click it. That's it. That's how I did it last time. Will you try to click and hold it? Yeah. yeah get, some, to... get some nine mils. They're going to be vital. I was trying to click it and move it along, yeah. Yeah. Okay, Yeah, that should do it. Right, yeah. so are we thinking, can we save it? No. Okay, we can't come back to it. Just just, just go until you die, I assume. Okay. Uh, yeah, I know, we're looking at the time of past an hour. Hearing that the shadow has gone from s- as far as some yet. Yeah? Nice. So he's gone from sticking a cyanide tablet in his tal- to going, tal- in his mouth to going, oh my to God. To recommending holiday destinations. He's, he's turning into a travel agent. He's thinking, oh, I need a new job. <laughs> I'll be a travel agent instead. Um, you can, I don't think you're going to get to some all in eight hours. No, I'm never going to get there. He's going gonna, to he's gonna, he's gonna yell at you for not going to some all soon. That's fine. It's just Scotland. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I think it's like on the border. It's probably in England. Well, do, Where are you as going? As long as it's the other side of Hadrian's Wall, that's fine. <laughs> I'm going to Sawchurch because it has a nice name. <laughs> and I want to see what Sawchurch looks like. That would be um, an interesting place, I suppose. I, I do like... Going. A lot of these names feel fairly real. If yeah. a bit, like, Very dark. English. Yeah. I think very English. Sawchurch, the town is suffering under infestation of small scuttling sores. <laughs> too large to be bow sores. <laughs> Not to mention too aggressive and too organised. <laughs> they just sat around the table like, right, Keith, you're going to want to go to Mrs Pilkington's house and eat her face. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that really tickled me. <laughs> Keith's like, got it, boss. Um, I'll be back in a moment. <laughs> right, Ryan, you're on, you're on cat duty again. I know, I know, but it's got to get done. <laughs> There's like 50 cats. We've got, to, we've got to make sure the entrails are in a nice pile over here. Spelling out the words, fuck you. <laughs> it's just what we do as demons. And Stephen, Stephen, you've got to go around nibbling holes in all four corners of the church. <laughs> just so it all collapses in on itself. Why? It's full of sores. I don't know why. I don't know. I don't know why. Um, I can't understand humans. It's just it's just what they do. Um, I, I suppose that's why we're killing them. <laughs> this is Pilkington's face. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, teenager. This is like some weird sort of weird science shit. Like yeah. that thing that they movie in the 80s where he builds a woman. Oh, I've got another... Oh, another nest! Oh, let me nice. switch over to your nine mils. Thank you, buddy. Because they're less valuable. 
Yeah, I, I, I mean, I brush my teeth with them. That, <laughs> that in the, just shoot your teeth out with them. <laughs> you really don't need to shoot them ones. I know, but I, I just I panicked. The name Nyx, as well as the associated symbol, is only ever inscribed in white pigment. It's only ever put on the side of white pigs. <laughs> to do so otherwise. Um, <laughs> they don't have speckled pigs. <laughs> um, speckled pigs. Oh, I'm having a right laugh. Um, <laughs> oh, hollow point bullets. Oh, we probably shouldn't have filled them. I don't know, I think we had room for them. What, can you only carry a certain amount? You can only carry six of them, yeah. Is this the nest? No, that, that's, oh, a, dead that's a dead body that you've just shot. Now the police are going to be after you. In like, it's still... Oh, no. no. Ooh. Ugh. That's oh. a horrible thought. I don't like this. Do you know what scene like, weirdly gives me the heebie-jeebies? Come on. You know um, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull, that Indiana Jones film? Yeah. You know that scene where the man gets dragged away by the ants? Yeah. I just think about that and it really upsets me. Because he's dead. He's definitely dead. Um, he's dead. Um, he's very dead. <laughs> he's taken underground and eaten alive by ants dead. Did I ever tell you about uh, when I was in primary school we had to... And you were eaten alive by ants. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was Keith. After he finished Mr. Pilkington's face, I was next on the list. He, went... <laughs> he popped outside, he got the scroll out. It was like, right, that's Mrs. Pilkington's face. Done. I've got Blake. Is it... A foot. I've got to get... Oh, okay. I thought it was just diabetes. More right. Um, <laughs> no, we had to write a story about the uh, the Bakerloo flea. Oh, right. And what I decided to do was make it into like an action like horror story. So it was like a story that I wrote about... Yeah. I, I wrote about um, these like Navy SEAL looking guys, right? Who, oh, you are low on health. I'd recommend fucking off. Who got sent in to deal with the, the, this giant flea that lived underneath London. Right. In, in, no, that's the story of the Bakerloo flea. He lives on the Bakerloo line. He's a massive. Oh, well, flea. I thought you meant it was like an actual like flea infestation. No, 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 no. It was like a big, a big flea that was living in the Bakerloo line. So I had this idea, like loads of little fleas, like living all around London. These like burst out of the ground like termites and eat people. And there was a scene in that where one of the commando fellas is in the zoo. And there's like there's a bit where a giraffe gets pulled underground by the sheer like strength of fleas, and then he stands <laughs> over like two holes, and the fleas grab one leg each, pull him down, split him in half. This was in primary school. Yeah, I wrote that in primary school. Yeah, Did, and they didn't send you off to an institution. <laughs> I had to go see. A... They didn't call up the nice men in the white coats with the large net and the big syringe. I had to. I had to go see the school council. But six weeks after that, I'd recommend going to a, um, a place that's safe. Go Bills Road because you need health. Yeah, that's what I, that's that's what I wrote about. And at the end, he rolls underneath the big flea and cuts it all on its belly and all the little flea babies fall out. And this big tirade. I remember when we were given um, the option to do, like, the stories like, around a certain subject. I just, like, made up my, I made up my own head cannon about time splitters. <laughs> that, that's what I did with my time as a child. You didn't write scary, disturbing stories about fleas. Um, no. What am I, I going to do? I get out of the car and caution... Or walk. kill yourself. Uh, well, in her early 20s arms. spiked me down when I pulled up she burst into tears and fell to her knees she looks exhausted I think my, un- I think uninjured but she is spattered with blood for some sauce or another I'm going to slap her <laughs> I get out of the car and cautiously walk towards her displaying my palms but though she becomes aware that I'm approaching she gives a shriek and lunges for me slap her wait slap her <laughs> my hand makes always unnatural as it connects and it's something Mrs. Pilkington. comes off Mrs. Pilkington's here <laughs> a bloody human face slaps wetly on the ground the creature then abandons subterfuge and makes to attack. Mrs. Pilkington gathered up it's, her it's face. It's Keith who took Mrs. Pilkington's <laughs> face. And he's like, hello! He's like that bloke from Repo the Generic he Opera. He just keeps sticking his tongue to the little mouth. I'll go, nah, 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 nah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Shoot him. Um, oh, that's a disgusting sound. Yeah. Oh, you are very low on health. You want to heal if you can get in your car. Let's get in yeah, my car. Yeah, go to your left. Oh, stop. Oh, you can... Never mind. It's just uh, go left. And uh, heal yourself there. I'm heal myself. Might as well use the med kit before you fill it back up. Oh, do you even have the cash? I think it's only like 20 to... F- yeah, enter town. And uh, f- visit hospital. F- refill med kit, yeah. And then you're going to want to heal yourself again, I'm afraid. Okay. Um, Return to car. Okay. I'd recommend. Sorry, I'm telling yeah, you no, how no, to do No, that's fine, now. no, no. Uh, if you think that's a good idea. So let's do that. So you're going to fill your health? <coughs> no. Jesus. Jesus, man. It got you a good way there, though. We've not even found any clues yet about what monster we're fighting. Well, we've found clues, but none of them can be connected together yet. Uh, Slaxing? Why not? Why not, mate? My throat's really hurting. I think I'm coming down with something. Yeah. Do you think we should do Saxing and then call it a day? Whether you die or not? Yeah. Oh, it just seems like an odd place to end. I know, you know, I know. But like, we've got stuff to be doing, and also... 
we yeah we don't want to be like doing this all evening so it's too long for you to edit yeah, down yeah yeah no never mind yeah just okay do this one and we'll let's go uh, to Waterley and see what's in Waterley uh, okay see what could what could have happened and then we'll work from there because after talking about oh that. The, the, the flea story you see he's telling you off for not taking a holiday <laughs> I don't see you fucking doing any work thing about it mate <laughs> just rolling a cyanide pill around your mouth <laughs> I'm, I'm going to text him like I quit I'm out <laughs> I'm, I'm rowing to Mexico on first a of all row. isn't this your sat nav that they're texting you through how are they doing that <laughs> That's weird, right? <laughs> right, if you want to conclude up, Nathan, that's, okay. that's how far we've got. I do he died once, but I'm definitely going to come back and do another run on this, I think, at some point. Oh, yeah, I do recommend it. It is for sale now. I um, I originally had it as the uh, beta version. I loved it. And then as soon as I saw the uh, full version came out, I bought it. It's not massively expensive. It's on Steam. Mm-hmm. So keep a look out for it. I didn't get the Steam version. I got the Humble Bundle version, which is a shame. But with that, I got like the uh, the books that he's written as well, which oh, is excellent. always nice. It's always a nice addition. Yeah, that's Ben Yarsi Croshaw. Ben Yarsi Croshaw. Big who, thumbs up uh, like of it. zero punctuation fame. I know he hates being called that. Yeah, but I saw the yeah. Let's drown out where he talks about of, that. Of fame for the books Jam and uh, Mog World. Yeah, Jam, very good book. Absolutely love it. Very funny. Um, but as far as this goes, massive thumbs up. I'm yeah, happy with I, it. I really like this game. I just never get enough time to play it. So thank you very much for watching us, ladies and gentlemen. We'll see you in, in the, the next, next episode video. for more face eating. <laughs> Kenneth, you bastard. Yeah. That, but I don't know why that tickled me so much. <laughs> do, you want to, do you want to call it Mrs. Pilkington's face? Yes, please. Yeah, can we call it Mrs. Pilkington's face? Um, <laughs>